Welcome, sports betters from around the world. This is your friend Joe coming to you live from L.A. <laughs> well, not live, but recording here on a Wednesday afternoon. And uh, I'm just laughing because uh, <laughs> I read so many emails before uh, you know I get all my uh, capping done and, uh, and messages. And um, one of the guys from our chat uh, named Brian, he sent me a message saying, Joe, you know what? Uh, I lost the video play. Uh, basically, he said he went 5-2. and two And, uh, you know, he was saying, you know, I lost the video play, but I won all the other bets that you were on and some of the guys on chat. And uh, that's what's important. I know, uh, you know, I've had some also messages saying that, Joe, you know what, uh, you know, don't give half some more. We've lost two in a row, which we have. But uh, I don't look at that any other way, but it's just numbers. I mean, it just so happens the video play loses, but that doesn't mean that's the only play I do. You know, I have like six to seven plays as you guys know, there in our chat that I play, uh, we're in our live group talking about hockey plays. We're talking about NBA. Uh, we're doing live. So, you know, I just want to make sure that, uh, I guess, clear because people just think that, uh, you know, one play is the, you know, win all. Let's bet 10 units. No. I mean, if anything, I strongly, strongly always suggest bet everything the same. If you're betting half a unit on 10 games, that's fine. Half unit, half unit, half unit. If you're betting one unit on eight games, one unit, one unit. That, that's fine. Do it that way. Um, that's just my opinion, and that's why I say with this uh, video play, with my personal plays, with the live plays, you know, they're all the same. They're just numbers. I mean, I mean, go look last night, and I don't get emotional. That's one of the things that a lot of guys uh, in our chat uh, take things like emotional, like, oh, man, you know, this, this bet lost, and I was on the wrong side. And, you know, okay, that's fine. You lose the play, you move on. I mean, last night, the uh, <laughs> Sixers, that was our bet here for the video, and uh, I had them, you know, uh, and uh, <laughs> the first half looked great. I mean, I was watching the whole game. They won the first quarter, which I said, okay, cool. This is a good, uh, you know, they're playing good. They're running a good pattern. My Lakers are kind of playing slow. Well, four minutes left. The Sixers are up by 10. I have plus seven and a half. So I got a 17 and a half point cushion. No kidding. I mean, if you guys saw the game, what happens? They lose the lead, and then they give up. More points, and they don't even cover the half. So that's frustrating. I know guys have bet it, but at the same time, it's just another play. It's just another play, again, like the other seven, eight plays I bet in the night. And that's very important to remember because guys always ask me, you know, in emails or messages or uh, even in the chat, Joe, I just got a message right now. And one of the guys asked me, Joe, what, 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 do, you, what do you think about the OKC game? I go, I like it. I like the first quarter. I like the first half. You know, I like the full game. He said, well, which one is your best What? Again, they're all like my children. If I'm going to make a bet on a game, I like it equally, whether it's one game, two games, or ten games. And that's why I'm so selective on what I bet pregame and live. And uh, I'm not betting no 30, 40 games, you know. And so that, that's important to remember, guys. So uh, I know keep that in mind as you watch this video, as you're in our chat. And then, by the way, our chat is free. So if you're in there and you're just catching, like I said, my play, you know, Jared's plays, Philly's plays, a couple other guys that are in there putting plays and community picks we have, I mean, you'll win. You'll win if you pick and choose and, uh, like I said, stay on the same betting, the same unit sizes on each game. Uh, you'll do all right. I mean, none of this, and again, I'm going to hammer this home. Do not bet, you know, 10 games and bet, you know, each game one unit, and then you just pick one game and bet 10. Uh, that's that's just so bad because what if you win all nine games and you lose that one you bet 10 units on? It don't make no sense. It does not make sense. I don't know why people do it. Uh, if you want to keep doing it, that's fine. But take that into consideration as you watch this video, as you watch other people's videos on YouTube. You know, they're just plays. They're plays that we all want to win. Well, I'm speaking for myself. I want to win it because I'm betting it. And uh, that's the way it goes. So, again, keep that in mind. Let's get this play now. Enough of the, the disclosure here. But, uh, but it's that support. I want to get that out because I was really kind of bummed out that I lost the play for you guys. But, again, if you uh, followed all the plays I was on yesterday... In the video, I even said a couple plays. I said, guys, take the Clippers trifecta. I love them. All, you know, all cash. You know, uh, there was just a couple of things I mentioned in the video yesterday. Also, I mentioned in chat. So, that's what's important. Because if I like a play, I'm going to bet it. And that's my play. So, again, all the same. All right. So, here's a play. We're going to go to Memphis. We're going to stick to a full game. You know, we're going to stay away from the house. Maybe the house are bad luck. But, no, nah, I don't believe I don't believe in luck either. Bad or good luck. You win, you lose. It's just numbers. Move on. And let's get going. So we got Memphis playing. Uh, Memphis is playing the Nets. And the Nets, very interesting game if you had <laughs> the Nets last night. I didn't have any action on that. 
but I was watching guys in chat just uh, totally fall, like I guess just melt because Boston they went into OT. If you guys saw the game, and the Nets end up winning. I think they scored like I don't know how many points that fourth quarter, eighty or. Uh, it was a ridiculous quarter. It even went over. I mean, that those are the type of games that you're like, man, that's a bad beat, you know. But but again, that happens. So you have to be careful. So again, Nets a big win last night against Boston. Now again, here comes little old Memphis that I've been fading, you know, and uh, I've uh, kind of stopped now because they cost me a bet. Uh, the first half they beat my Hawks, you know, my team that I like. So that was a very uh, important game for me because I was watching it, and you know. The uh, Grizzlies, young group, I mean, John Morant, they're playing like on fire. I don't know what happened is maybe they got home after those four ugly losses against the Clippers. They got embarrassed against the Lakers, Rockets. I mean, they just, they look bad. So maybe they got home, maybe a, a player's meeting. I don't know, but they've been playing very, very well as of late. You know, uh, and uh, again, I'm not going to fade them. When a team is doing hot or starts getting back on, on track here, I'll back them. So the bet I got here going, it, the line kind of moves, so it kind of sucks with a full game. I got it earlier, you know, at plus two. It's now plus one now, the full game. So I still like it because I think the Memphis Grizzlies win outright against the Brooklyn Nets. Again, Nets coming off a huge win against Boston last night. I mean, emotionally drained. I mean, I don't even know how they're going to get up for this game. And Memphis, I think, is going to come in and hand them their lunch. So I also like the first half. First quarter and the full game for Memphis. So uh, just to give you a little bit of a heads up. Uh, also, another game that I'm going to be betting. I already mentioned it earlier. I like OKC first quarter minus two and a half. Uh, first half minus four and a half. And OKC full game against uh, Detroit, which I guess has nobody playing. No guards. I don't even know who's playing for Detroit. The Pistons. That's, that's, that should be a smash spot here. I don't know how. I mean, I could be totally wrong. And, you know, Detroit comes out. But I don't know how with the... Uh, the players they have, and not only that, the, the what scares me the total. I was liking the total, but it's gone way too low. I mean, it's been steamed down to 210, 209 and a half on some books, so I'm not touching that total. Maybe a live play, so like that. And uh, another play that a lot of guys in the chat were uh, talking about uh, last night again, uh, we're talking about the Bucks uh, after that embarrassing loss that uh, they should uh, come here and smash the Pacers in this spot. So I was also not getting the Bucks first quarter and first half. I haven't made that official yet on my card, but I'm liking that. And uh, also like Mavs minus six. I'm going to see if uh, the line moves a little bit lower, maybe getting like a minus five. But uh, that might be a good life spot. So anyways, guys, those are the games that I'm looking at to bet. Remember that? Those are all equal like the video play, but I know I have. I want to give one play out because, like I said, we want to keep track of what we're doing. So, again, the play will be the Memphis Grizzlies. Uh, plus one, take the plus one. But, again, I think they win the game outright, and that'll be my official play. And, uh, again, all the other games I mentioned, I like them. I'm going to bet them. If you want more information, if you want to know what I am, Jared, Philly, and the guys in there, come on in the chat. It's free. You could kind of, uh, you know, just look what we're betting. Uh, the live channel, uh, the voice chat, has been on fire. Last night, I'm just looking at what we did last night, just a quick recap. We went 13-3 and three in our voice channel, which is basically, we just talk about the games. We bet them live. They were all NHL mainly because uh, a lot of the guys in there are NHL guys. So, I mean, we just kicked butt in there. So, again, if you guys want to come in, come on in. It's free to the chat. Check it out. We have, like I said, other things in there to offer. So, uh, let's get this win. Again, Let's get off these halves. So uh, shout out to you, Mike, that left me a message. Get off the halves. I'm getting off the halves, and we're going to take the whole game here. So let's get this. See you on our chat. See you in live betting because I'm going to be there pretty soon, and we'll get this. And, hey, MLB's coming up. Mets just beat the cards. I like it. All right, peace.